Repeat after me. Hola amigos. Hola amigos. Soy Jane. Soy Jane. Y esto es Fincarte. Y esto es Fincarte. After the storm the other day, I noticed that the solar system had stopped working, solar water heating, and there's an error code for the temperature sensor on the solar panels. Meh, so, hot water's overrated. So I have to go onto the roof to investigate. Yeah. So there's nothing obvious, but the sensor does join further down the line, and it's not the first time it's broken. This is the second one we've had. Anyway, I shall do some continuity checking later. But while I was up here, I'd noticed that the birds have been making nests in the gutter underneath the flat roof. And blocking up the gutter. The gutter is superfluous. It was originally put here when there was no veranda. And they just left it and put a pipe at the end to direct the water down. So to stop the birds further nesting in it and causing more problems, I'm going to remove the whole gutter. But while I'm up here, it's always great to look at the view when you're a little bit higher. Our neighbour's casita, our friend's Casa Royale in the distance in the shadows of San Cristobal. To remove the guttering I have to undo these soft clips which hold the guttering on with a rod underneath that goes into the wall. This will also make it easier for me to paint when I come to redo that. There are always things breaking. Always. Sorry about the camera work. You just can't get the stuff these days. So this is the guttering off now. You can see the bird's nest or the rubbish they've left. There was actually a nest, two nests in fact, but totally waterlogged now. However, I've taken it out and recovered it, put it here, and it actually contained eggs. But whether the actual bird will come back again, I do not know. Anyway, so that's the nest off the This remains for me to clean it all out and probably use it somewhere else. It really doesn't need to be here now. Like I said, it also makes it easier for me to paint the house.
So I don't know how, but, and it wasn't just me playing with the temperature sensor for the solar collector, but the solar water heating system is working again. Woohoo! It looks like it might have been a bad connection between the control unit and the junction box. But if it works, it works. On to the next thing. Thank you for watching. Call back anytime.